Hi guys, um, we are trying something different today. We are thinking about making those videos in English. And for this first one, we'd like to give some tips for people who will be visiting Brazil this Olympics. Uh, so we thought about a few things that would be a main difficulties for people visiting us and we'd like to go over them. So, five easy tips for foreigners people in Brazil. Number one, the most important thing is don't show your cell phone when you are outside. Well, it is a cultural thing, I think, for people outside of Brazil to walk around with their cell phones because it's safe. Well, in Brazil, it's not that safe. And I'm not just talking about Rio, I'm talking about everywhere in Brazil, mostly the big cities. Uh, if you are unattentive, looking at your cell phone, walking around, someone will come in, grab your phone and run away. So avoid that. And even and if you must use your cell phone, be attentive of your surroundings and you know hold it closely and pay attention. Second, never paying dollars. Well, most places in Brazil do not accept dollars, so you have to change exchange your money anyways. But there are some uh, vendors that will accept it, but they will charge you double or three times what you would pay if you had cash. So be mindful of your money and always exchange your money before buying anything. Third. I always admire things, close your bags and keep them closed to your body. Well, um, people will always find ways to bump on you or if you're not paying close attention, someone will sneak and get your stuff. So always be mindful of your things. You know, I have my purse, I have it close to my body, it is closed. I do not have my cell phone on outside pockets. So always keep them close to you and pay attention. Pay attention. To help surround us. Surround them. <laughs> and pay attention of your surroundings. Always. Number four, avoid taking valuables to the beach. Well, there is this thing that happens usually in Rio. It's called ahasta. Some robbers, you know, will come and a lot of them. And they will take things from everyone at the beach. In a group. In a group. You know, in a large group, they'll come and rob everyone. And also, if you don't have someone on the beach to watch while you, you go take a swim, it can also be dangerous, you know, for them to come and take your documents, your cell phone, your hotel keys. So, as much as possible, avoid bringing things to the beach. So bring the essentials, your sunscreen, uh, a hat, something that you wouldn't mind that much losing because it's not that it's going to happen, but it might. It is a possibility, so just be careful. And not for foreigners, for everyone. For everyone, yes. Okay. Number five, careful take transportations. Prefer taxis that turn on the taximeter or public service yes the thing is there are some illegal transportation companies in in everywhere in brazil so the thing about the taxi meter is that sometimes they will agree with you on a price but it will be the double the amount you would pay if they turned on the taxi meter uh, but it, you can always negotiate, they like to negotiate the price and also, uh, but always ask at your hotel, your hostel, uh, if you're staying at someone's house to guide you to which is the best transportation because it can be dangerous. It has happened other times that people took transportations that were illegal and they end up, ended up in bad places and bad situations. So just be careful. Okay, ask around, see if it's legit. And that's that. So we hope it's helpful for you. And if 
you liked it, leave the comments. Help the love. Yeah. Thumbs like up. the video. <laughs> thumbs up. And we really liked trying this new thing. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.